Hello guys, it's Peter from PS Sounds and um, in this video I'd like to show you my, my new tool, my new SSA Audio SPR meter. Um, yeah, sorry sorry that I've been a bit quiet in the last few weeks. I promise you that I would try to um, upload videos on a weekly basis to, you know, share my projects with you, but I've been flat out. Uh, this, this period of time is absolutely mental. But um, this tool seems to be pretty cool. Um, so what do we have? I have a Sansa up on the windscreen right now. And what you see now on the, on the bottom of the video, um, with this application, you can record a video while showing the, the scores. Um, it shows you peak SPL, as you can see there, the frequency where it peaks in the given moment, and then the real time um, SPL. So yeah, it, it looks pretty cool and it seems to be pretty accurate as well. Let's just stop that music and then we play a bit of frequency. So at the moment we are playing 20 hertz and it shows 20 hertz. So yeah, it's bang on. Let's go a little bit further up. 79.6, it's one hertz accurate, it looks like. So we go down to 77 and it shows 77. Yeah, it's pretty bang on. Um, I don't want to turn it up right now. It's pretty late and I don't want to kill the neighborhood. But then I thought we could, we could just do something really silly. If we drop it down to 10 Hertz, no one is going to hear that other than the car we are want to fall apart or the whole house, but it shouldn't spread in the street. So let's make it what 10.1. Just a quick measurement. I just turned it up. The whole car is sealed right now. All the windows are up and then we will see what happens. Well, 132.5, just a quick, you know, I didn't even turn it up full. We still had 9 dB left on the processor, but I'm not even sure how the sub likes 10 Hertz sign tone. Um, but yeah, the, the 118, 18-inch 18 FI in the back is, is definitely capable. Uh, it's quite, quite fun. Many people have heard it in the last few weeks and um, no one has complained. You can still... You know, use it for SQ SQ purposes, or turn the sub level up on the director separately, and then go a bit bonkers. But yeah, normally on my SQ preset, it's on minus 20 dB. That's how much headroom I have on the sub, which is fun. But then yeah, this this tool is gonna be pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna try to show you videos how you can also use this for tuning purposes for SQ, not just for SPL. Um, why it's sometimes it's better than just a pure RTA. But yeah, this, this tool only uh, measures in between 10 up to 100 hertz as far as I remember. Um, but yeah, I, I like it so far. Yeah, if, if guys, if you like what you see, please subscribe because uh, then you never miss any video. And um, yeah, let me know if you have any questions and uh yeah stay cool